I can't believe I had to watch Cyber Chase on PBS Kids. Ever since Ron Pardo took over the voice of Digit from season 14 forward, I now have a bad taste in this show. Well, Bodhi Boo, let's see if our band Mittens and the Borealis crew has made the charts with the hits we've covered, sampled, and done. After that, let's track Hurricane Michelle to see if it dissipated or not. I love watching Wild West Cowboys of Moo Mesa with you, Spud, Nico, Giglish, Stomp, and Stamp. I can't wait to see what Marshall Moo Montana, Dakota Dude, and the Colorado Kid and their horses Cyclone, Rebel, and Jezebel are all going to do next. Woof. Ruby Frank, you are under arrest for drinking alcohol on your one-year anniversary of your aggravated child abuse arrest, which is last year. Get in the police car because Dobie, Papillon, and I are taking you back to prison. Fiddlesticks. Arrested again. Okay, but FBI agent Rhiannon and I are not arresting you. But we are giving you a warning. If you drink alcohol two more times, you are hereby transferred to a behavioral health hospital in Walton, between 50 and 100 miles outside of the Fort Klein slash Molly Springs area in McFarland County. Angela, sister of a 19-year-old Tibetan Mastiff, is that okay for him? Yes, officers. As a matter of fact, Bodhi will be 21 in a couple years from now. It is best to store the remaining alcoholic drinks away from him and for him to only drink alcohol on certain occasions, including family functions. Right. You can do that as long as this Tibetan Mastiff, who is only 19, does it with you and makes sure that it is stored away in a safe place such as a basement closet. Hey, little pug, let me join you. Sure. Hold on there, trick shot. My little puglet is too young to drink, so should you transfer the drink to another person? She is not 21 until 2040. She is only five and goes to school just to get an education. Oh, sorry. My bad, Chip Roo. Hand over so I can get the next person who is 21 and over to drink it. Ruby Frank, I hate to say this, but you did not get part of the sixth Rock Dog movie due to the aggravated child abuse arrest last year. That means you get no role. Also, you are disqualified. Get the hell out of here and go back to the mental hospital right now. Fiddlesticks. My villain role is foiled yet again. You get a good job, Bodie and Ellie, which means you two get minor roles. Just keep going and you two will get the part in no time at all. Cool. We get minor roles. At least it's better than not getting parts. Right, Mom? Yes, sweetie. Congratulations, Chip, Spud, Nico, Giglish, Stomp, and Stamp. You six got parts for the sixth Rock Dog movie. Which means every single one of you is qualified. Yeah. Chip, you, your brother, Nico, Stomp, and Stamp all got parts for Rock Dog 6. The rock never stops. We can't wait to see our parts for this movie when it comes out at the beginning of 2030. <laughs> Oh no! True died! Please wake up! I promise I can do better! <laughs> Too late, Ruby Frank. You mean old witch. True had already died from lack of care. That's it. For making True die from lack of care and not making True feel better so she can go back to her rainbow kingdom, you're hereby fired from being a doctor. Now leave MUSC Black River right now or I will call the police to send you back to Lighthouse Behavioral Health Hospital down in Conway. Fudge. So, Dr. Bodie, how am I feeling right now? 
you're getting a little better, but you're doing okay. But you and your mom will both have to stay together in the hospital for one day. And Mama Llama, there's a pull-out couch for you to sleep on, and I will pull the bed out of it when it's bedtime for him. Nope. But I'll pick up Llama tomorrow morning at 9.30. Feel free to call me by 9.20 tomorrow. Okay, Mrs. Llama. You are good to go. See you tomorrow morning. Oh, okay. At least I'm getting a little better, and I don't have to stay at MUSC Black River for a week. Don't worry, Bodie. You're still doing a good job. Just keep up the good work, and you'll get a promotion eventually. On top of that, you might bring any of your brothers or sisters, or even your parents to work with you just to help you out for the day. So, Dr. Chip, how am I feeling? Today's your lucky day, Ty Matthewson. You're feeling so much better today. And for that, since you got here today, you don't have to stay here for one day, and you get to go home today. Well, no problem, Chiptastic. See you later. Congratulations, Chip. You made my boyfriend feel so much better in less than a day. And for all your hard work, I'm going to promote you. <laughs> Bodie, are you okay? Say something. Bodie, you're having a seizure. Let me take you to the hospital. Oh no. Your potato pal told me that you're having a seizure. Let me take you to your room and into bed so that you'll stop seizing. Bye.